Hello and welcome to this Cloud Academy course on the OSI and TCP IP networking models. Before we start, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Jeremy Cook. I'm one of the trainers here at Cloud Academy, specializing in AWS. Feel free to connect with either myself or the wider team here at Cloud Academy regarding anything about this course. You can email us at support at cloudacademy.com. Alternatively, our online community forum is available for your feedback. In this training course, you'll be introduced to the OSI model, followed by the TCP IP model. An understanding of both models is important for learning, architecting and or operating large scale networks. Both models will provide you with fundamental networking knowledge. Much of everything else you learn in the network learning path will be in some way based on the underlying foundational models presented here. To start with, the Open System Interconnection Model is a seven-layer reference model used to aid both learning, building, and troubleshooting of networks. Next, the TCP-IP model is a more simplified four-layer model that's used in the implementation of real-world networks such as the internet and or private networks, such as corporate LANs. The TCP-IP model created in the 1970s predates the OSI model later created in the 1980s. In this course, we'll learn the layering specifics of each model, and at the same time, how both models differ from one another. The agenda for this course is as follows. We'll review the OSI model and detail each of its seven layers. We'll review the TCP IP model and detail each of its four layers. We'll provide an understanding of the upper and lower layer groupings within each model. We'll review the differences between the two models. We'll focus on how the TCP IP model uses logical and physical addressing schemes in the transmission of data. We'll focus on how TCP IP model routes packets of data between devices. We'll review the TCP IP network stack in detail, discussing core protocols that make it up, and many of the common application protocols that leverage it. Finally, we'll spend some time reviewing the TCP IP network stack from top to bottom and how it's used to implement and operate real-world networks. The following prerequisites will be both useful and helpful for this course. General networking exposure and or skills. Furthermore, if you require an introduction to AWS virtual private clouds and or associated networking concepts, then please consider taking the VPC-related courses here on Cloud Academy.